Hi, this is Dr. Greg Gillum, CEO of Human Fusion. Welcome back to Reinventing Performance Management. Now in this video, we're gonna talk about how Deloitte um, really got the impetus to change their entire performance review system. Now think about, the company is 65,000 people. They, um, they would set objectives at a very, very high level and then they would cascade those objectives down through the organization so that everyone would simply have you know a set of goals much like your organization most likely um, and then after every single project was finished they, the managers would then rate each employee on how well they did on that project and then at the end of the year let's say they finished three four or five projects whatever those um, individual ratings would they be, would then be condensed into a single year in rating okay much like many of the organizations that I go into, they have an annual performance re review with one single rating at the end. All right, well, one of the things that employees actually liked about the process was the predictability of it. They knew when it was coming up and then they could plan for it and they, they liked that. But the folks that were, that were the team that were, that were assigned to, um, uh, to, to look at the process really um, just kind of, came out and said it. You know, one single year end uh, evaluations ratings are just way too batched for real time. So we move, moving in a VUCA world, there's absolutely no way that a single year end rating can capture the essence of a person's performance for an entire year, okay? That's pretty, we, we kind of take that for granted now, but this is when we were first started, sort of looking at how this, this concept kind of emerged. And then this is what did it. This was the clincher. They went back and looked at how many hours were actually spent on the performance review process. This is a staggering number. Two million hours spent on the performance review process. And most of that was looking at, you know, managers behind closed doors kind of, you know, hashing back and forth the process. And so they asked a very central question. Why can't we look at changing the investment of those hours from, from something that's looking back to something that's looking forward and, and look at uh, f how we can affect future performance with our conversations? And that, my friends, was the game changer uh, for Deloitte. And if you think of that, so, so put aside the article now, if you think about feedback, the way it's best delivered is future is a way to, to, to affect future performance. So, you know, uh, in the feedback model that we teach here at Human Fusion um, doesn't talk about the past, it really focuses on future performance. And I think that's correct, and I think they got it right um, here. So in the next video, we're gonna talk about the science of ratings and why a human being cannot possibly rate another human being on a competency. I hope you tune in for that. If you like management related videos like this, please subscribe to Human Fusion and we'll try to keep you up to date on all the latest management trends that are affecting your practice today. Thanks.